Today, I'm going to make the, be making a YouTube video that demonstrates how well the Model 625 series hand dredges, whether it's the hand dredge or the bilge pump style gold hand dredge, doesn't matter which one it is. It's the same pump with a different discharge valve. But today I'm going to be proving that the Model 625 series and the Model 2125 series are for gold prospectors. Now, just to make it more challenging, what I did today is I brought along some gold nuggets. Now, these gold nuggets, they're real gold nuggets, as you can see. And I'm going to dump those into a two-gallon bucket and use the Model 2125 and the Model 625 to pull those nuggets all the way up through the hand dredge and into a specimen bag. Okay, now they're all down there inside the bucket. Okay, I have the model 625 HDP Bilsman Sagol hand ridge set up with the 24 inch telescoping pipe assembly and the 4x6 specimen bag. It's a 300 micron specimen bag, so I already know that the gold nuggets aren't going to be leaving once they get pumped into it. Okay, are we ready? get those out there into the bucket. Okay, there they are. Okay. Hey, let's get the rest of them. There we go. So the gold nuggets are no longer inside the bucket. Let's see if they're inside the hand pump. More than likely they made it all the way through the hand pump and into the specimen bag. Well that's what we have to see now. Are they in the hand pump? I don't see them in the hand pump. They don't appear to be in the hand pump. Okay, let's see if they're in the specimen bag. Oh, look here. One, there's two. Oh, there are all three in there. Fantastic. One, two, and three. All three of the gold nuggets made it through the Model 625 HDP Bilge Plus Gold Hand Dredge and into the specimen bag. Very good. Okay, now let's get those same three nuggets and we'll put those back into the two gallon bucket after I fill it up with water. Now this is the model 2125 hand dredge. This is my two inch hand dredge from Golden Sipper Products. It's got a 2 inch steel lined restrictor nozzle built right into the 12 inch length of pipe. It's about what, 13, 14 inches all the way to the end right here, so that's a long way for those big gold nuggets to travel through and out the discharge valve. Now, my Model 625 HDP, that's an inch and a half hand dredge, that's got a steel lined restrictor nozzle. It drew that gold all the way up those 24 inches out through the discharge valve.
Okay, now we're set to go with the Model 2125 HDP handridge. Uh, or I should say Model 2125 HD handridge. Okay, elbow on, now on the model 2125, the elbow can be rotated and so can the discharge valve, so if you get it over here you can keep the discharge valve in the right position. Okay, let's get those three gold nuggets and put them down in the water here. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Okay. Now I don't see the nuggets down in the bucket any longer, so more than likely they are in the hand ridge. Either that or they went through the specimen bucket. Let's see if they're still let's see if they're in the hand ridge. No, I don't see them in the hand dredge. Let's see if they're in the specimen bucket, or I should say the specimen bag. Oh yeah, nice gold showing. One, two, all three of them made it through and into the specimen bag. So we know that the Model 625 HDP and the Model 2125 can both be used for gold prospecting.